tactic of vet as a rookie. There he is, top of the screen, good hands, didn't fall for the double move. Now, Taylor could have thrown it out a little bit, but he's leading him right. Top of the screen again, and Tillman with the, he fakes the post, and he goes back to the corner. Pretty good move. Elijah Cooks makes a couple different plays. Seth Williams comes in and says, hey, it's my turn. Let me make a play. And once again, you see him stretch out, make a terrific catch. But it's another former Green Bay Packer and Malik Taylor who makes a brilliant catch. I can't tell you how hard that is. You see him, he's on the outside right here. And you're just going to see him do a double move, a little sluggo route cornerback bit he did a great job of Marco was shaken up by the way in that play on the near side of the field that just his key trail beautiful timing look at this route I mean he's on top of him puts the brakes on Brandon Ayuk he is ready for a huge year of uh, Aaron Rodgers here it is close up receiver looks back he catches it in stride and to think that here you'll see Romeo Dobbs has his corner beat. See how he's drifting to the sideline? You want to try and stay in. Give the quarterback. Ambry Thomas gets beat here. Now you see the second the double level. Move. He, he tries to jump a little out and up. Jalen Virgil gets behind him, but no problem. Safety is a safety for a re yeah, as soon as check that Kelsey Ringo with the defense for Philip. Soon as that ball, soon as the receiver puts his left out there to make the deflection, he allows him to get inside. Boom! You can't allow him to get back leverage outside to the sideline. That's one heck of a route and a catch. Coming on the blitz, but as we go out here to Josh Butler, he does a great job of just shadowing the receiver, not making any too many handsy moves. Stays in the hip pocket when he breaks down, gets his hand in. Terrific drive. Oh, it's good. In route. tandem. Oh, he sets the feet. And he turns, he tries to secure the catch. He comes around, stays with it. Deontay Johnson against uh, McCollum here is, you know, he did, this guy didn't score a touchdown last year. Chris. To the ground, I didn't know that he was able to hold on to I it. I think him and Rakeem Jarrett are, in, or, no, it's Kalen, Kalen Geiger are in the same area. And it, Jake Browning threw a great pass right there. That is one pass that you can have perfect coverage. Yeah, he did a great job just getting outside release. Staying when you talked about earlier, you guys heard me talk about trying to keep the sideline space. He does a good job of keeping a little small. You just had a bust of coverage, guy was squatting on the route, double move by Jones, and then it's just about making sure you don't blow the layup. Great pass by Bethard, nicely by Jones. To come back to the football and make a play. That ball typically you would expect it to be thrown. He's got good coverage here. Watch, he doesn't panic at the top, and you're gonna watch and see if he gets two feet in down here. Well, Jahan Dotson, I, I think he's poised to, to really have a, an exceptional year. He's an outstanding route runner. You see it there. And like I said earlier. Making a heck of a comeback tonight. Basically, what he did, he gave he gave a stutter to Rush, and the rookie bit. A little bit with this off coverage. Boom, right there, coming out of the break. There's nothing to stop them. That's like throwing routes on air. He has to do something. He's on the right pass. He's throwing to the left sideline. Look, he stays patient, a little active hands a little bit. You run that fade and you throw it inside. That's a great job coming back to the ball. Take a look. Perfect technique. He opens and then he drives and right on time. No chance of a pass interference and he continues to fight. What did they do? Come right back to it on the left side. Clear out with the boundary guy. There's the quick move right there. We saw Julian Edelman West. He's getting the ball out of his hands fast. He's reading things really well. And he's accurate with the foot speed on top of speed. Let's just take a look here. Here he is, just diagnosing the play right away. He sits, he waits, he diagnoses. It's a screen. Boom! Ball in the pocket with the pressure. Rondell Moore just went in a quick little in route. I believe you could just lead him, let him. You know, Barrios didn't have to. He didn't have to slow down, stop, just kept going. It would have been a... It's been a nice, nice play. So the Dolphins move down the field for the second time, but unable to get any points, it remains. He was working on A.J. Green, and that is just a dime and a nifty catch. Cam Sims. Cam Sims goes with the high points. It. Butler did a great job of staying in the hip pocket, but like some of the young guys have done this preseason, they just didn't get his head around. Great grab, got the ball, elbow down, knee down, first down. Sure who this was intended to. I think Kirkland just goes scramble drill. He sees his quarter, but to your point, Matt, perfect throw. Yeah, this, this is what he has been in.
Yeah, now he's coming up. He reads to play correctly, but he did not break down. And when you don't break down, you don't have breaks when you're going against 60% completion. NFL average is 64. Yeah, he, no, I think he is basically a bench route. He's going to take it to the corner late on the throw. But the awareness, he saw the receiver, you know, pitch and catch with the, the duress he was under and how he delivered the, the football and a nice, accurate throw. Five, six years into the league to the point now, expectations are totally different. Yeah, but that's a good thing. Right. right? Yes. Right. When, when expectations are to, not just to win the division. You're going to match up in man. And so here he is. He's keeping in front. He's not going to get beat deep. Too much of a cushion. Man. His ability to high point. He's been doing this for a long time. And in this case, Christian Harris, the second-year player out of Alabama, was the, was the victim of another Jimmy Graham moment here in New Orleans. By Trey Brown. Trey Brown, again, staying with his receiver, keeping his eyes on his luggage is what they like to call it. Trey Brown saying, no, no, no touchdowns on my watch. We'll be back. For the Arizona Cardinals on this possession right here. Sasha right, right there misses that tackle. 12 personnel, quarterback sets up in the pocket, and you hit how Last few plays, he sees it, comes up, maybe got there a little earlier than he should have, but. Off you back in your hometown. I mean, definitely get back home, um, definitely compete against a great team. You know, can't wait to get that good food, too, so definitely looking forward to getting back home. He just missed times his jump, but really a nice catch, good tracking of the football. Watch this. Boom. He's got his eyes on it. He sees it. Panthers are a two-point conversion away from pulling this to within a one-point game. Great throw, but watch the top of the screen. Keely Ringo stopped right here. He stopped, turned around for the ball. He doesn't see it. Oh, man. Eagles will go for two to try to regain the lead. So we were just talking about the importance of not making mistakes. Becker allows Davis to have the time to get the ball out right here at the sticks. Stand channel, they get the, 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 the calmness that he's got in the pocket. You know, he, if he's got to get out. He does a good job of looking at him off, coming in, boom, runs a nice little shake route right across the middle, touchdown. Harris had to stick with him, but it was close the whole way. Yeah, Tyron Johnson did a heck of a job of getting off the line of scrimmage, getting his hands free, and then simply he had about a two-yard buffer there. And George Pickens, you see him at the top of the screen in man-to-man -man coverage against McCollum, and that ball is so perfectly placed behind the linebacker, 52 KJ Fritt, and inside of your corner. And then this guy, he's good. Take a look at your slot matchup here. So it's trips really to one side. Outside leverage, that's a great route. He stems it, creates some space there. Man-to-man -man coverage, you see it at the bottom of the screen. at the line of scrimmage. He wins at the line of scrimmage. It gives him a chance to stay in phase. And then just the concentration, man. That is a great pick by the second-year player. Also a twin, by the way. I don't know if all yeah, of y'all yeah, know that. Yeah, I know you're big on twins. <laughs>